Welcome back to the 2021 Idea House. I'm Amy Matthews. Since we saw you last, things have definitely started heating up on the inside. The mechanicals have all been roughed in. The drywallers came in and got things buttoned up. And the painters even have a coat on the walls. Now we're turning our sights to the hardwood flooring. With this particular installation, because the wood is five inches wide, we wanted to do what's called a glue assist install. That means we're not just nailing the floorboards down, but we're gluing them as well. The wood is always going to want to move. It expands and contracts. We're going to prevent it as best we can from doing that. So the glue assist means that you can't just put a regular tar paper down and or felt paper and nail over that. You've got to actually glue onto the floor, which means the subfloor not only needs to be clean, but best practice is to put a vapor barrier down. So the floor was cleaned with a diamond blade rotary tool, and then the vapor barrier was painted on, and then it, it dries in this lovely green color. And then on top of that, we do both the gluing and and the nailing of the floor. It already feels really solid. It feels timeless. It feels like it's been here forever and it's gonna give a great finish in the long run. And check this out. In order to maintain all of the great character that is in this wood naturally, we're gonna be putting epoxy into these knots right here where you can see all of the different gorgeous colorings through each one of them. And what that does is when the epoxy goes inside, it holds on to that, that look. And then when the sealant goes on over top, it won't change the inside of that knot. It gives a great character feel and definitely ages the wood and brings out all of its personality, which is exactly what I'm looking for in a new house that I want to look old. In the owner's bath, the team is installing a super effective shower system that will allow me to create a customized and completely watertight zero entry shower with electric floor warming for luxury and comfort. You know you've turned a corner when the finished material starts showing up. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is why you make a zero entry shower. So you can have a beautiful, continuous, large format tile that makes the space seem seamless. Now that my tile has arrived, Tim gets to work. One consideration if you're thinking about using large format tile is that even though the cost of the tile can sometimes be lower per square foot, the tile is more difficult to cut and heavier to work with, which means the install could actually be more expensive. I'm trying to find the perfect black stain for the cedar on the exterior of the building. So the cedar will be the banding that runs horizontally between all of the windows. And then the cedar will also be the cladding that goes on the outside and inside of the chimney, which is about a 25, 30 foot peak. So I've pre-conditioned a few pieces of cedar and tried gel stains and the Cabot oil stain on them. And now I wanna try the stain and the gel without using a pre-conditioner. So that's actually quite beautiful and I don't know how much different it is than the one that I pre-conditioned. Okay, so that's good news. And the gel stains generally don't have as much pigment. You have to leave them on longer to get a little more color. Yeah, I've definitely got a lot more penetration into the wood from the oil based and it's a more intense black leaving it on for the same amount of time so if that's the color that I eventually want to get to I think that that oil based stain is the way to go it just means I have to stain everything outside which is really quite nice because it's lovely out these are my favorite people in the world and I'm so glad they're here today because I would have an issue when the ciders show up tomorrow. It's like less than 24 hours away that this is going on the house. Good times. Thanks, guys.
When we come back, the interior palette will be coming to life, and the outbuilding that houses the workshop and the guest house will finally get its day. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.